Okay, let's talk about working with multiple subtools or meshes. So I have a lollipop here that is, is composed by two different pieces, the lollipop and the stick. I unwrap them using UV Master Unwrap. I wrap them separately, so each one has its own UV space. If I bring them into Substance Painter, and I make the low poly with the high poly mesh, and leave everything in its default settings, I'll just bake all textures. Where the meshes intersect, I'm going to have baking errors. The way you can avoid this is by going to Common, coming down here, and where it says Match, instead of Always, choose by Mesh Name. Because I have two different meshes, I have two different texture sets, it, it will bake them separately, so that bleeding will not occur. Now the place we have to go, is ambient occlusion. So same thing goes in ambient occlusion, only same mesh name. Make sure you press apply to all because I'm only looking at the lollipop. So you can select different meshes here. Now you can bake all texture sets and you won't have the same error. No bleeding occurred now. Now if this was for just illustration purposes, just for to do an image or a render or something like that, this would be fine. But if you, let's say you want to do a game prop and you want to bring this lollipop into a game engine. So in the next video, you're going to talk about how we can improve our UV space because this is nowhere acceptable to bring into a game engine. So like and subscribe, press the bell symbol, support me on Patreon, and I'll see you in the next video.